वेलकम बैक स्टूडेंट्स आई एम डॉक्टर सुजाता कसबे फ्रॉम आबा साहेब गरवारी कॉलेज पुणे एम ऑफ द एक्सपेरिमेंट इज सिंथेसिस ऑफ पोटेशियम ट्रायऑक्सोलेट फेरेट ट्रायहाइड्रेट थ्योरी आयरन फॉर्म्स स्टेबल चेनेट कॉम्प्लेक्सेस द ऑक्सोलेट कॉम्प्लेक्स कैन बी प्रिपेयर्ड इन अ स्टेट ऑफ हाई प्योरिटी फ्रॉम इजीली अवेलेबल केमिकल्स दो दिस कॉम्प्लेक्स इज वेरी मच स्टेबल टुवर्ड्स डिसोसिएशन इट इज photosensitive due to the oxidation of oxalate ion by fe3 and so decomposes to fe2o4 and co2 it is an example of high spin iron octahedral complex it is two step preparation in the first step ferrous oxalate is prepared in the second step reaction between fe2o4 h2c2o4 and k2c2o4 is carried out to get the desired product apparatus measuring cylinder beaker glass rod and filter paper etc the required chemicals are ferrous ammonium sulfate potassium oxalate 10% oxalic acid and hydrogen peroxide first step is preparation of ferrous oxalate before starting the experiment please subscribe like and share the video to get the notification of next video step 1 is weigh accurately 1.875 g of ferrous ammonium sulfate crystals and take 10 ml distilled water in a test tube to this 10 ml distilled water add ferrous ammonium sulfate crystal and stir it well now to this solution add 1 to 2 ml dilute h2so4 with constant stirring and then add 10 ml 10% oxalic acid with constant stirring now heat this solution very cautiously on low flame and then cool it well here yellow crystals of ferrous oxalate will appear now filter this solution through buckner funnel and then wash it with hot water and finally with the acetone now transfer these crystals on a watch glass next step is the preparation of triazolate of ferrate for this weigh exactly 1.250 g of potassium oxalate then take 10 ml distilled water to this add this potassium oxalate and then add to this solution previously prepared ferrous oxalate with constant stirring now to this solution add 5 ml h2o2 maintain the temperature at 40 degree centigrade here ppt of feoh thrice will appear then dissolve this ppt of feoh thrice by the addition of 5 ml 10% oxalic acid and maintain the temperature while the addition of 5 ml 10% oxalic acid to boil thereafter filter this solution when it is hot then add 5 ml ethyl alcohol heat the solution now keep this solution in a dark filter the bright green color crystals of triazolate ferrate by using buckner funnel then wash it with ethyl alcohol finally wash it with acetone then transfer the crystals of triazolate ferrate on watch glass so this is the final product calculations to calculate theoretical yield starting compound is ferrous ammonium sulfate and end product is potassium ferrate trihydrate so 292 g of fas corresponds to 491 g of potassium ferrate trihydrate therefore 1.875 g corresponds to 2.384 g of complex to calculate percentage practical yield 2.384 g of complex corresponds to 100% yield 
therefore w gram of complex equal to 100 into w divided by 2.384 which is equal to z percent of the complex resultable color of the product bright green theoretical yield of complex 2.384 gram practical yield of complex w gram percentage practical yield z percent so students thank you for watching this video please subscribe like and share the video to get the notification of next videos